the Methodist Church, and we they had a big pumpkin patch, and I got a mess of pumpkins. Whatever they have left over, I'll come back and get tomorrow probably, or later today. And uh, this is for the sheep. I do not eat pumpkin that many pumpkin pies. This is for the sheep. Uh, I've seen sheep eat them, cow eat them, goats eat them. So uh, I'm getting a load of pumpkins. Getting a load of pumpkins. Well, there's my pumpkins unloaded. I just put them uh, on my back to earth garden plot on one of them. That's my other one. And uh, just threw them out. I got a couple of them that are starting to get a little rotten. Uh, about three of them. I think those three there are uh, are uh, beginning to uh, go a little bit. But I'll cut these up, give them to the sheep. You know they they don't know what they are right now. They're a little uh, little uh, apprehensive of them. Not not a, that's not the right word. A little uh, doubtful as to whether or not they want to eat them. But they will. Uh, gave them some to the chickens. Chickens eat them pretty good. And we'll just see, 68 pumpkins for free, 68 pumpkins. If you got a place near you that has a pumpkin patch at Halloween, sells a lot of pumpkins, and uh, you might want to check with them before Halloween is over and say, what you going to do with your leftover pumpkins? Here's what they let me have. And I could have got more. Could have got a lot more. I could have got another load probably like this. Just figured, why well, be greedy? <laughs> anyway, pumpkins for sheep, pumpkins for livestock. Cattle eat them, sheep eat them, goats eat them. Pumpkins, get you some.